I'm Elise. You can't tell, but I have a metabolic disorder called PKU, or phenylketonuria. That means that I have to have a low protein diet. And I can't have meat, most dairy, and most grain. So, and I can eat fruit and veggies. How many, how many grams of protein are you allowed to have each day? I can have five grams. So can you give me an idea of how, what, how much would be a gram of protein? A gram of protein would be an Oreo packet or a packet of potato sticks. Okay, and how about, say, something like a banana? How much banana could you have for one gram? How much banana? Is one gram. one gram. How about, say, McDonald's chips or something? Me what size? Um, more large. Well, you tell me. Small? Well, a small is, um, I think it's two and a half. Right. What other food or other supplements and things do you have? I have to have my special low flex drink that I call my Juicy. And what's in that? Um, all of my other protein that I don't have with meat and other foods that I can't have. And so, what happens if you have too much protein? Um, my brain, if I continuously keep on doing it, my brain just slowly shrinks and shrinks and shrinks. That wouldn't be good, would it? No. Um, and if you have, if you eat your pro, if you make sure you don't have too much protein and you have your special drinks, yeah. is everything... I'm a completely normal kid. Like can... everyone else, like, like Lauren. Oh, so Lauren, do you have PKU? No. No? See, look, she can... How do you know you don't have PKU? Um, because she didn't have the... Um, she had the heel prick when she was just born and she didn't have PKU. Uh-huh. And what is that when it? is that when you found out you had PKU? Yeah. 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 You have to have a special hair prick test on your heel. And yeah. will you? how long will you have to be on the diet for? For my whole life, but they used to stop people, when they kids, were when they were eight years old. Right. Nine. No, Why would they do that? Because they thought that they'll be all strong by then and they'll stop and growing they're and stuff. fully grown. But it's not very clever because their brain's not fully developed. So yes. she's missing an enzyme in her liver. So she can't enzyme. digest. Enzyme. Not an enzyme. It's enzyme. Yeah, that's what I said. Enzyme. Yeah, yeah that's what I said. Not enzyme really. in her liver that she can't digest a lot of protein. Is there anything else you want to tell us about PKU? Yeah. yeah. An Look. average um, teenager or something has 50 grams of protein each day. And so when you get bigger, when you get to say uh, an adult, will it be more than 5 grams? No, maybe, probably maybe 6 grams because um, she had high levels for a while, but now they're coming down and they're getting back into normal range. So they'll probably go up to 6 and then she'll mainly stay between 5, 6 and 7. So at least like. how do you know, how, how do they test your levels? Um, mum or dad gives me a thumb prick or when I was little they gave me a heel prick on her heel. Can you show me? That's my heel. Can, can we do a heel. test? Can you show me what it looks like? I got it. For a baby, um, they for their heel prick test, they have to fill say? up three of these circles. But for at least we just have to fill up one. And so, so with the blood. they just pump with blood. Pump my arm and then blood goes on to one of these circles then you have to send it to my doctor and um then he tests it and he sends the levels back to us and we see if i ha can have more protein or less protein